Uh, it turns out that the team that we were also supposed to play today is able to play just a little bit later of a time. So we all had to rush back here and get this all working. Um, and if you want to join me. Yeah, sure. Yeah, scoot right in. So I actually have a co-commentator now. It is the coach. Welcome, Coach Blackman, Coach Aaron. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, so right away, already two goals have been scored. Uh, do we know by who? Um, uh, yeah, us. Yep. Yeah, so, us. Uh, I meant like on our team. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Yep. Okay, so one by Nate, it looked like, and one by Todd, or one by Alex. Okay. Yep. So Nate and Alex have already scored for us already in the first minute of the game, and they might score again already as it looks like the it's going to be bounced into the air. So exactly, like, what exactly is the plan here on offense for them other than, like, calling for passes and stuff? Uh, sure. I mean, it, they're working to try and set something up uh, depending on um, how well their hit goes. Uh, typically then if they they don't have anything else or they don't have a good angle uh, to try and keep going, pushing forward mm -hmm. to either bump one of the defenders out of the goal. Um, yep, sorry. Uh, yeah. Looks like Unstoppable just scored. Yes. So it looks like Blue Team is able to score there right past our defense. Is it, we will start off here with a tip-off or is it kickoff? Kickoff, yep. Kickoff, okay. So it will start on the orange side, but I have noticed that it doesn't really matter that much which side it starts on as it usually always gets bumped right back on the other side. As Todd is going in for that aerial goal, it's, it's still in the middle of the goal and going right on that side. Ooh, oh, very good save there from Alex. Kind of just barely able to save it there, knocking into the wall. It looked, ooh, and that will go right over both of our team there. Yeah, that was just a little bit of broken defense here. Uh, you can see um, Alex kind of goes up. Uh, Nate was just kind of sitting there, and mm -hmm. I think it was just a little miscommunication on who was going to block that. Yeah. All right, we got the, the three in the back here. Um, and it looks like we will start with the ball here, almost right onto the goal right away as it looks like it'll go right back onto the orange side, however. And now the blue team has already tied it up very quickly as it looks like Nate is going to clear the ball. That's the right term, at least, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, because I, I remember clearing used to be a thing. You would used to get points for it <laughs> when I played this <laughs> game a very long time ago. As it looks like we are able to defend that offense there as we are able to almost get a shot perfectly on goal, but the blue team will block it there as it looks like they will okay the ball's still on the blue side as uh so those orange balls they give you a hundred boost right uh sure yeah so boost uh they're, they're small boost and then uh, the large boost so there are two in the back corners uh and then two right in the middle on the side so six total big boost and then a lot of small boosts kind of uh, spread throughout yeah those will give you just 20. okay and it looks like we are able to stop the first and maybe oh we are able to get that second defensive stop there just barely by todd thankfully he was sitting right in the goal and, oh. and we'll get a score there from nate beautiful score there through the defense what exactly do you think of that goal right there? It, it, that's scary. Uh, we we nearly had it scored on us. Um, mm -hmm. And so thankfully they were able to pull that back, but yeah. Woof. <laughs> that is Nate's second goal already of this game. Very uh, off to a hot, hot start for him as it looks like the ball will be going, uh, will be him right back maybe onto the blue side from here uh, for Todd as he will follow it in the air. Might be able to get some kind of air dribble going. But it looks like he'll just land on the ground. He might be he will be able to get it kind of close as he will get Very nice. there, the destruction there into that. So it looks like our team got destroyed there at the end though. That's all right. Yeah. Uh, so everybody has a goal now at this point. Nice. Uh, Don is sitting up 4-2 with 155 remaining. Yeah. So I have like, how long is an average like point, I guess? Because I know they can range from five seconds to three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it just kind of depends on the team, right? Mm -hmm. um, in the last series, we were having pretty high scoring games, uh, but it could very well be, you know, a 1-0 match. Um, and so it just kind of depends. Um, yeah. All right. So we will get back to, uh, to more talking about this match as it looks like, oh, and that will be a goal right there as soon as we get back to talking. It looks like uh, they were playing some pretty decent defense until right there as it looks like uh, is that 
Is that yeah, that's, Alex there? Yeah, that's Alex. Yeah. Just just didn't get it cleared far mm -hmm. enough away from the goal, and yeah, and, and no one else was there to help him. So. Yeah, Grim from the other side had a had a really good shot right there. Yep. And it looks like right there is that Alex? I can't really tell. Okay. So Todd is defending right now, and he will be able to maybe knock that away as it keeps getting bounced off the. Yep. He will be able to clear it there as he will go right into like a collision with the other guy right there. And Alex will be going back as Nate will push it onto the blue side as following it as best as he can, grabbing that 100 boost. Oh, Todd just barely missing it. Alex is going right back to get it back, hopefully bouncing it off the side and just following it up the wall maybe as he collides with the other team. As now Nate is going for his try at taking it and will miss it, but Todd will take it instead, knocking it into the air right there in the middle might be able to create something out of this. Todd's still following it. Alex going in, but will just barely get blocks. Very close there to, if no defender was there, we would've gotten that goal for sure. As Todd will knock it into the air, the blue team will go, but Todd will just hit it right above them, making sure that they can't really block it or clear it that much. Nate will get it back into the middle as the ball is going right on a collision course for the backboard. Is that is that the term for behind the goal? Or is... Yep. Okay, so it is backboard, all right just like basketball, and that was very close to being a bounce and goal. Good save from Blue there, as it will bounce, and only 10 seconds left. They need to just keep this lead for just a little bit longer and keep the, ground, yeah. uh, keep the ball on the ground. As soon as this ball hits the ground, it is over. Ooh. Ooh. Oh! <sighs> Probably could not hear the reaction. Uh, I should not, I should have closed the door, but yeah, that was very wow. close. Wow. That, Yikes. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> that was probably like a frame off, if not less. That was very lucky right at the end there. Um, very close to going into overtime. Um, so how exactly does overtime work other than it's sudden death? Uh, yep, yeah, just sudden death. It will go as long as possible. I mean, until somebody scores. Uh, and so, yeah. All right. So... That game, very much of a thriller. What do you expect from the rest of these games? Uh, hopefully a lot like that. Um, obviously, you know, as a caster, we want to see great games. Uh, being from this school, we want our team to win. But, mm -hmm. um, yeah, as long as it's close, yeah. that's great. Yeah, I we're mean, not biased at all. Keep it competitive. Okay. We're not biased. We're not biased commentators, I swear. Uh, <laughs> All right, and we will be starting here with the second match here as the ball is going to start mostly on the orange side as it looks like it might be hit right back on the blue side, but blue will be able to knock it back into it as orange might be able to get something going off of that clear from, the own, from their own blue team, but blue will be able to knock it right back in, keeping their offense alive as Todd will keep it in the air, going for some air juggles. I heard him talking about this before the match that he would try and keep it on him the whole time, use some Gorilla Glue or something like that. Uh, that might be cheating. What do you think? Is Gorilla Blue cheating? <laughs> oh. Very close to a goal there from Blue Team, but will just barely hit off the wall as Todd will dribble it and hit it off the backboard as it looks like... Um... Oh. oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you from the chat there um, as it looks like the, the game will continue going on as our uh, Orange is now on defense. And the, the, it looks like Orange will be able to hopefully clear this ball as Blue will be able to knock it back into the wall, keeping their offense alive just a little bit longer as it looks like Alex is able to hit the ball away and it looks like it's up to Nate to block it here, but Todd will come in from behind the net to block it. as the, It's going right back, but it looks like that's Alex there hitting it there, yep. And he will be able to clear it back onto the blue side as blue will hit it off the wall into the air, setting up Todd for maybe something of a little bit of an offensive play, but won't be able to get anything out of it. As both of his teammates are on the defense, and Nate will be able to clear it onto the blue side as he will be able to push it, as blue will be able to push it back in. And almost scoring there, but great save from Nate. We've seen some great saves from him these uh, last few series. Do you think defense is a strong aspect of our team or is it more the offense uh yes i would i would probably say the defense um 
definitely last series there were some times where uh, they were just kind of get jumbled up, uh, some miscommunication on who was going to take it, and then just some hesitancy. They were just waiting too long, and so the ball was just staying way too close to our goal. Um, mm -hmm. And so hopefully they can kind of, uh, you know, fix that for this series. Yeah. So it looks like we almost had Todd there going for another aerial. It looks like he'll go for it there. He might get that shot in, but all three of the blue team is there to defend. Oh, almost Nate coming in with the backup shot. We'll be able to maybe stop this with uh, with his rear side, able to stop it. Mostly, we'll be, Blue almost lined that up perfectly. We'll, Blue, then we'll destroy Nate. Todd keeping it in the air, might be able to keep get something out of this. We'll get a nice dribble. We'll get it knocked away, sadly, as he's as no one has scored so far. As a very deep shot from Blue. Commentators curse yet again. <laughs> as, Right from the air, a good assist there from blue team, setting up his teammate very well as Orange's offense, as our, our offense wasn't super far, wasn't back yet really. As we will start with another kickoff here. Uh, really starting kind of mostly on Orange side here. Hopefully we can knock that away with uh, Todd here following the ball pretty well. Nate will hit it first and then Todd will go for it, almost getting that goal, but will just be off just barely. And might be able to get this one, but just will be blocked off by the blue team there. As he's going to rotate back into this. Might be able to get something out of this with Alex clearing the ball. Just barely missing. But Todd will instead clear it. Or that's Nate. <laughs> that, that's Nate there clearing the ball. As now Todd, now we're looking at Todd. As it looks like he is making a rotation to try and make a play on this ball. As it's kind of stagnating right there in the middle for both teams as as there goes uh that that's todd keeping it in the air with some dribbles he might be able to get something out of this but this might end with a very low score as time is dwindling down it is on the blue side blue is able to knock it away some pretty good defense from blue here and it, that's a pretty good arc but we'll just barely bounce off the backboard we might get something out of it anyways right in the middle oh just barely still very hovering near their goal, but it looks like they won't be able to get anything out of it. As some air dribbles are coming through, but barely misses there from the blue team as it looks like Alex might go up and try and get it, but doesn't have enough boost for it. As, ooh, very nice save there from Alex as he just kind of sits in front of the ball and a good collision course. Blue will take it there, but Nate will be able to stop it. Uh, will be able to steal it again as the blue team will be able to go off the, off the wall and might be able to try something, but it looks like he'll stay on the blue side side. Uh, blue side and might be able to get something out of this with uh, orange all being on on the blue team amazing save from Alex just barely able to make it in time as time is dwindling down orange needs to score here is, is there like there's not much time here we need like somewhat of like a miracle almost but I think there might be something coming here blue is in the or the Todd is in the air with the ball, and the ball get hit right over to our net. Another defensive save there, I think, as it gets bounced away. This last second, the ball will fall, and that will be the second match. All right, so it's one to one. How do you think that one went? Um, that one was tougher. Um, mm. Yeah, I think that uh, we just weren't quite fast enough. Yeah. Um, they definitely, our, our team definitely has some pretty good defense, as we can see from the stats. Each each player has at least one save. Mm -hmm. uh, Nate with three as the leader there. One, two, three, actually. Very yeah, but uh, you can also look at the just just the offense there. We only had three total shots on their oh, goal, yeah. and you know they had ten. Mm -hmm. Right. So yeah. uh, hopefully, uh, yeah, I think you can ready up. Yeah. Yep. All right. And we will be starting up this next match really quick. Can you hand me my water really quick? Yeah. yeah. Zoidstein, if you were still in the, the chat, thank you so much for that. Uh, we really appreciate that tip. Mm -hmm. We are brand new, um, but we're, we're working our way through it. Yes. And this is technically the second stream of Rocket League, <laughs> <laughs> as we were just barely able to get this game going. As it looks like we will start up here again very quickly with kickoff as it will start on orange side, but is that that is Alex there going up in the air to try and get it. As blue is there able to defend just barely. Might be able to get something with the ball kind of close to it as Todd will knock it back onto the blue team, bounce off of that, and might be able to get something going here for offense as it looks like uh, that's Alex back. 
trying to defend and will be Todd will be going into the air to not to clear it there. But blue is also go has the same aerial tricks, but Todd will just go up again as that is a pretty close goal to or ball to the goal as Todd's going up again to try and get it on their side. As it looks like they might be able to get something uh, through this, but Alex is in the enemy team's goal as he is trying to make his rotation back. He might be able to get something out of this as he's going to well, it's going to bounce right off the wall there, not go into the goal, thankfully. As it bounces off the wall, might be able to center it just a little bit, but it looks like everything will be decently all right for now. We just need to get this ball out of the out of our side and might be able to get something going on offense. As it looks like maybe something will happen with Nate's clear here as uh, it's going to be stopped by Blue again. Blue has been really thwarting us on these clears, but that's a good clear from Blue themselves, as it looks like Blue will try and get it back onto our side really quick. But we do have some people here to knock it back, and one will miss. The second one really won't, I guess. Uh, and, ooh, that was very close from our angle, at least, it looked like. Might be able to get something here with Todd in the air with the ball, but not really anything there. Uh, is it's go it's still on the orange side is we are on the hard defense and we can't really get anything started on offense as it looks like we might be oh and that's a shot right on the goal but will just barely miss as Todd is able to save it and block it away Nay is able to clear it a little bit more but that's just gonna uh, blues just gonna center it again as Todd is able to take it away this time might be able to get something out of this Oh, will hit it again. Might be able to get through all three defenders. Just barely get stopped by a good save from Blue. Looks like Blue is able to almost clear it again. As it seems like they might be able to use an aerial approach, but, but Alex is going for it. Is able to at least hit it out of the hands of the other car. Might be able to. Oh, uh, Blue is able to get it on the on the orange side. They might be able to do something with this. Uh, as no one still has scored any points, and it's been about two and a half minutes as oh, this is getting very close to scoring on orange's side but orange needs to clear this right now as it looks like we have todd up in the air clearing it that was some miscommunication you can see both todd and nate going up after it mm. yeah honestly i think you leave that to todd after all he is the more proficient and especially in those aerials right there as it looks like nate turning upside down, kind of flailing around the defensive side here, but we'll be able to still get that clear out. And as Blue still stops it though, no one is able to stop the, the stop of the clear, I guess. Oh, but Alex is here to clear it again, almost on that angle too for the goal. If no, no defender there might have gone in. Todd is able to, oh, Todd misses that just barely as he gets that 100 and runs by. He might be able to get something out of this as Todd hits it there. Might be able to get, oh, it is centered. Might be able to get something for offense here as it is passed to Nate. Might be able to get something, but Blue will steal it again as they are, Blue is doing a very good job of just keeping it on Orange's side while Orange is doing a great job of defending this whole time, even with the relentless attack. It looks like um, Blue is going to, yeah, keep it going a little bit longer. It looks like there's still been no scores yet as Todd will hit it there. Might be able to get something out of this, but Blue's going to try their best to defend. And it's going to go over all the defenders. Oh, it's going to be very close, but won't be able to get it right there. And maybe something can turn around and be happen right there. Todd is a little bit under, is a little bit low, it looks like. Um, and might, and the ball's going to bounce off the backboard. Very close there to being an own goal, I think, there. As it looked like that was our own team going, hitting the ball into the corner there. Very good lucky for us that nothing happened too disastrous, I guess. Um, it looks like everything is just on the defense for Orange. Might be able to get something out of this. This offense might be going somewhat well as it's bouncing off. It might It's going in the kind of right direction, but now it's going back. As it just keeps going back and forth. Nate's or Todd's there right now to stop it, but it, we got 10 seconds. Somebody's got to score. Otherwise, we'll be going into overtime with a zero point overtime. Uh, as it looks like Todd might be trying to set somebody up as, oh, very close there. As uh, these two matches have either gone to overtime or gotten very close to going to overtime. And that was, oh, oh. that was the, that was an own goal. That was an own goal there. As we, yeah, we can watch it right here. So Todd hits it there only. Cause watch, 
He doesn't oh. hit it there. It's an yeah, own goal. Yeah, they, yeah. Did, they just couldn't quite get back in time mm -hmm. to to get it. Uh, so yeah, pretty close to a kickoff goal there. Um, yeah. Woo. Very impressive defensive masterclass of that match, especially from the orange team. Is yeah, you could see the five. Uh, no, that's seven four shot. saves. Yeah, seven shots to yeah. five. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Woo. A very close <laughs> match there. Very, very nail biter on both sides. Um, yeah, so with that, Doan is up in the series 2-1. This is a yeah. best of five, so if they can pull off one more win, uh, they'll get their first win, series win. Yeah, so we did lose earlier, but just barely. Mm -hmm. We lost 2-3. Uh, to three. Yep. Um, and hopefully we can win this one, and we can have a little bit of a winning record in the preseason here. Um, as we will now start up this next match with the kickoff, as it looks like we will we will start mostly on the blue side offense for the for orange, as it looks like uh, we might be able to get something going here as blue will will clear, but Alex is there to stop it, as might be something happening here, but it looks like it's just kind of stagnating in the middle as now it's on the orange side and we're back on defense just like the last match. Hopefully we're not in the same position as the last match because that defensive was v probably very tiring for the other team, and they might have figured out some for our team. I mean, and yeah, yeah. When you spend you know <laughs> three, four minutes of that match just basically kind of rotating around your goal, stopping, stopping, um, it, it can be very stressful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it looks like it might go onto the blue side here, but it looks like blue's going to hit it there and off the off the ceiling almost scoring there as blue's going to go for it again. No one's there to really block it. Nate just barely coming in with the save. We have a good angle of him coming in right there, but he came in and saved it right there. Uh, and it looks like it might be able to clear it here as Nate will, as they'll hit it up into the sky and it will be on the blue side as it goes up on the wall, bounces off the ceiling. Might be able to get something going for Alex here as he's as now it's going to get knocked away by Nate in the air. But Blue is just right back on offense as they're going to go for it now. But Todd is there to save it. But Todd is like always everywhere, it feels like. <laughs> Todd is just in every play. <laughs> um, as it looks like uh, maybe something's going to happen here. With at least maybe, yeah, another save happens um, from Alex there coming in and we might be able to get something going here as it looks like that might be a decent setup as it goes into the air but it looks like that's blue's gonna set that up as alex gets a destruction there might be able to set up with one less defender as it looks like todd's gonna pass it to nate it's just barely gonna get blocked it looks like todd's gonna maybe just take this all the way but he's gonna get stopped by one and two basically so alex is gonna try and do something with it as nate comes in this time this looks like a flip of the script that was happening earlier as now it's all on Blue being on defense as that ball is getting very close, but Blue is still playing pretty good defense, almost on the same like tier as we were <laughs> as no one can score as now it's getting cleared back and look and a perfect block there from Alex to just right, just being a pole. That's what he needs to be. Just standing right in the air. Ooh! Oh, very close there. Ooh, wide open, wide open net. Wide open net. He just needs uh, to get there, and he yeah. won't be in time. Uh, just barely not fast enough. We'll now have to turn around and try and get this ball on the other side, but it looks like it'll go right into the orange as it will get knocked away and will get a destruction at least. Might be able to do something right now as our offense is transitioning. Might be able to get something as the rotation comes along. Might be able to do something with it as it's bouncing, but... Maybe not, as now it's still on the orange side, but, ooh, he misses that, so he might not be able to get through, as Blue might be able to start something with that. He Blue, yeah, orange, I mean. Orange might be able to start something with that, but it looks like they're just right back onto offense. This is a pretty much a repeat of game two, as no one has scored. It's one, one and a half minutes left, and it's just defense after defense. As it looks like Todd is trying to go up in the air, try to set up... Alex there, and they will get the first score of the game. And we will finally see another kickoff. <laughs> a very impressive score there. Great pass right yeah, in the middle. Yeah, great pass. Uh, all three of the defenders were there. They just they just weren't there for that angle. Yeah, they were just way too low, and Alex just went right over them. 
as we will see the kickoff just almost almost get a goal for orange that destruction oh. doesn't really save anyone as it just goes right in anyways should have gone for the ball instead of the person i guess yeah as you can see there's oh the destruction was from their team actually it looks like i think i don't know i don't know what happened <laughs> I just heard a big boom. They're not heard, but so. But it looks like uh, now it's one to one. So it's basically the same as last game. It's, we have kind of scored, but they scored right away again. As that is going right for the goal, but we have Nate there blocking. We might be able to get something going on offense here as Todd is in the back trying to stop, but now everybody needs to get back as the goal is almost open as Nate is able to steal it right away and able to get the ball going on offense. Todd takes it up, might be able to pass it to, to Nate there, but it looks like it might have been a little bit of miscommunication from Alex and Nate there, as they seemed like they were both going for it. Um, gonna get, Nate's going to get hit, might be able to get something with this, as the ball is going up in the air, might be able to get something from, uh, from Alex there, as he's trying to push the ball a little bit onto the blue side. That was Ooh. dangerous. Nate just kind of flipped it up, and it didn't really go anywhere. Mm -hmm. So, but um, still blocked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like we need a clear right here, and it looks like Todd will clear it there. That is dangerously close to the goal, as now it's in the air, but Blue will take it. That's almost a perfect shot from Blue. Oh, my oh. gosh. Another amazing save from Nate as he is able to extend this game right into overtime, pretty much. Actually, the ball is still in the air. There, there it is. Yep. As long as they didn't panic there because they got it a little away from the goal, but mm -hmm. uh, they did a, did a good job keeping it just enough away. Bring yep. it to overtime. Yep. And overtime will start with the ball on the blue side. Might be able to get something from this as the defense is kind of spread out. Hopefully we can get more spread out as Alex gets it right back onto their side as there's two there and one behind Alex as the net is fully open if someone's there, but they will be able to stop it. Yeah, they, they destroyed both of our teammates. So uh, <laughs> Yeah, it was yeah. just Alex. Agenator was was uh, on a just course for destruction. Mm -hmm. You can see in the top right. <laughs> I missed that, so thankfully you <laughs> saw it. But that's an almost pretty good shot as the oh. ball goes right in as Damn. from the, a goalie shot pretty much there um, as we will watch that one more time yep that is basically just a goalie shot as it goes right in no yeah we there to stop it didn't quite have coverage there in the middle um mm -hmm. rotating back and yeah some of those can be really dangerous <laughs> they can yeah they can go a long ways so uh, all right, so that is College of St. Benedict and St. John's University. Uh, they just won game number four, so that brings the series to a tie, 2-2. Yep, looks like we will have another game five, as these matches go a lot faster than Smash Bros. Smash Bros. <laughs> was taking an hour, this is taking 30 minutes. Yep, <laughs> yep. 30 minutes to 45 minutes-ish. High um, energy. Uh, yeah. it, it looks like uh, Dona is taking a little bit of time here. Um, you get 60 seconds in between your matches. Um, and so uh, probably discussing um, what they can do to kind of reset and uh, making sure that their spirits are up. Mm -hmm. we got one more. Yep. One more in them. And it looks like they will be starting here in the next about 10 seconds. Um, and we will get on to the last game of this series, hopefully bringing home a dub. Um, as now the teams are just joining is there hope is there any like what do you expect them like changes to be made here um really just kind of looking at um the rotations and if something was was a little broken there um and just kind of mostly a lot of it is, is mental they they know how to play they know yeah. how to uh do what they need to do it's just making sure that they can stay in the right mindset They've been playing now for almost two hours and uh, between the last series and this series. And so uh, it's just kind of, yeah, getting the, the expectations right back up for, okay, yeah, we can win this. We've won two. Um, and so these are close matches. Yeah, a little bit of fatigue probably setting in from these two hours of playing, right? Yeah. So it looks like there was a little stint of offense, but nothing really came of it as it looks like maybe now Orange is now, or us are now on the defense as we are now going on offense, but Blue will be able to stop us again 
as, oh, maybe Todd will be able to get something started, but Blue is right there again as they are pretty much trying to shut down Todd entirely. Alex is able to get it on the side, might be able to get something, but just barely not fast enough as our light turns off in the hallway. Um, as it looks like something might happen with Blue here as they knock it back into our side and there is one defender. Uh, Alex is there to stop it and now take it along the side but misses. It goes a little bit too high but Todd is there to stop the second attack as, he, as they just made it back in time. As he gets that 100 boost just as it spawns as it looks like he'll bounce off the wall and might be able to get something going uh, for Blue here or Orange. Might be something. The ball is just kind of stagnating on Orange's side, which isn't great for us. We need to clear it here soon, as it will bounce off the wall and might be able to get something going. As as maybe Nate will be able to clear it here. As no, Blue will be right there to stop the clear. As it looks like it's going to stay on Orange's side for a little bit longer, hopefully being able to stop it soon. As there's the clear, but another just these Blue defenders are everywhere stopping the clears. Good save there from Alex as he's able to stop the ball from going into the net. Maybe something from offense there. We need some some kind of aerial attack or something like that. But the ball got pretty close there, but it's on to direct sight. But Todd is there to stop it. Ooh, Ooh yeah, and the not, second shot. That was rough. No one can stop that. Yeah. So let, let's look at that again. As yeah, Todd is able to stop the first one, but Nate's just barely not fast enough to stop the second one. Maybe need to be a little bit further back there. Yeah, Todd's angle, um, I think, was fine. It just wasn't quite the right angle uh, for for the blue side, and so uh, they were able to get the better of that. And yeah, without that follow up defense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like the ball will be on. Uh, a few destructions going on throughout both sides. It looks like, um, but maybe something will come of this as, and it's scored right away again. Oh, sorry about that. Um, <laughs> yeah, there's just there was just not really anybody there to stop that. It looks like. Mhm. Mm it's all right. Uh, there's still two and a half minutes left. Um, yeah, they've got time. They've got plenty of time to score. They're gonna have to become a little more aggressive if they want to 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 get something here just mm -hmm. based on the last couple of games uh game two was one score game three was one score oh that's a goal there we go <laughs> there that's the first start todd will take that into the air and we'll take that score right away yeah just take that up right above the other defenders that that's kind of what we need it's just get above them or just kind of get lower than them because they do like going in the air a lot to stop those so we will start here with another kickoff. Uh, it looks like us. we will be starting a little bit on the defensive side as all three. Oh, Todd will be able to keep it going on the offense. Might be able to get something here. Decides to just jump over them instead of going for a destruction there. He could have gotten a, a destruction kill. As it looks like he might be able to get s something might be started here as the ball is in the air. Todd is taking it right to the goal, but it'll just bounce off the wall as it looks like it's just going to bounce again still on the blue side as Nate will turn around trying to get it but it looks like it'll be cleared by blue and then saved by Alex there at the end might be able to get something going as as Todd will take it as he'll go up in the air and just hit it right up instead of trying to dribble it in the air like normal as it looks like Alex is there to kind of stop the clear but not able to do it perfectly as blue is able to hit it off the wall as Todd is there in the air not really in a great defensive spot as Alex will get destroyed there. Might be able to get something here as the ball is pretty close, but all three defenders there. Now it's back on the blue side and Todd is on his way to the ball. He's going to hit it off the wall. It's going to fall right in front of the goal oh. and no one is there to say, to get it. Oh, that was very close though. Todd is right there in the middle. Might is I think going for a defense play there and we'll be able to get it away. Hopefully get a clear here soon. As, yep, Alex is there to clear it away. As it looks like we might be able to get something of offense as Todd is right there on the side. Nail will be able to re-engage it a little bit as it looks like Alex will be there to keep it going a little bit longer. They do need to score this very quickly in about the next 30 seconds as Blue's going to take it onto their side as Nate just barely misses as now the ball is in the middle and there's a few defenders left. Todd will knock it away into the air onto the other side. Might be able to get something going and they need to 
because it's only 20 seconds left and they need this score. Might be able to get something going for this as Todd will hit it into the air right onto the goal. Oh, Ooh, just barely misses there because of the because of the height of the goal. But might be able to get something as Nate almost repositions the ball. Todd is going for it. They have two seconds. It might go in right here. Oh, it's too far. The, the ball is still in the air. Mm, yeah. And that's oh, it. That was close. A very close game. Ooh. Uh, very close game from both teams. Very well played defense on both, honestly. Uh, do we want to bring Nate back into another interview? Yeah, yeah. I'll All go right. see if, uh, if he's interested. All right, perfect. Hopefully he's not using the restroom again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll wait for Nate really quick. That was... Very, very tense game from both sides. Um, all five games were very impressive from both teams. Um, I thought they did really well, and it was very fun to see that game. As Sadly, we did lose, but it was overall really fun and just really interesting game there. As Hopefully, we'll be able to interview one of the players here like we normally do on, this, on these streams. Um, He'll probably be coming in pretty soon. They're probably talking a little bit about the match, kind of what went wrong, um, what they could do better, what went right, how they can improve a little bit, as they did end up losing. But it it's all right. It's just the preseason. This In the end, this will just make whatever teams we play in the normal season a little bit easier. <laughs> and that's what we need, you know. We got to get into the playoffs, so... And that means we got to get in the top two of our division. So if we get an easier division, that's all the better. Um, all right, look, it sounds like he's coming in. Nope. All right. So I guess no interview today. So we will be heading off, I think for sure this time, right? All right. <laughs> so for sure this time we'll be heading off. So we'll see you Thursday, next Thursday at 7, something like that. Um, for the Overwatch first preseason game. All right. Bye. Thank you guys for